milk is an exclusively highly nutritious diet in our daily life and majority of these milk products are obtained from this cattle that might be cows or buffaloes and entirely the vegan variety of this milk is obtained from soya beans and this is entirely a plant based product usually this milk secreted as a plant sap is used commercially to manufacture or to create the rubber and this interesting video is on milk weeds and this video includes the uh, propagation methods of this uh, milk weeds as well as the chemical compounds present in this sap and little bit interesting facts about the uses of this milk in our indian kitchen and the last but not the least a little information on the ayurvedic properties or the uses of this plant in the indian traditional medicine and this milk weeds are botanically named as calotropis gigantea available in two colors one in white and another in purple and the propagation is quite simple where the wind acts as a main mode of uh, seed dispersal and if you want to plant these seeds manually you need to pluck out this matured uh, seed pods i just want to show the seed arrangement i just took a, a like kind of uh, uh, matured seed pod and i dissected using a bp blade you can also use a sharp knife and make sure you won't hurt yourself even you can notice this using out of this plant sap you know it's very interesting to see this pattern it's entirely symmetrical on both sides and this seed pod is a little bit raw and it's not been ripened or uh, matured and the seeds are usually like a play material where we used to play in our childhood so like we used to blow this into the air so these white hair like structures help the seeds to get dispersed to the wind and the leaves are so thick and the cover with a waxy layer you can also feel a white waxy and powdery residue on these leaves and this wax layer will help the plant to retain the water for more time and if you tear out the plant leaves the stems and it weaves but the tears are white in color and you must be extremely cautious while handling this milk and don't get splashed with the milk into your eyes the milk is entirely poisonous if it gets splashed into your eyes it may cause temporary blindness and this milk is used in an indian kitchens to prepare junnu and is called as jilleer junnu in telugu it contains a poison named as calotropin this plant has a traditional importance in hinduism it has been offered to Hindu gods like uh, Lord Shiva and Ganesha. Hope you liked today's video on milk weeds. And if you like the video, don't forget to share, like, comment, and subscribe, Dr. Gardner. And happy gardening.